Hey guys, we're here in Huntington Beach about to pick up our newest PAC member. We're going to be doing an in-home evaluation, meet his parents before taking him back to Hope Dog Training for a three-week overnight boarding train. Let's go meet him. Oh, see you is this our guy? This is our crazy Wally who oh gets my excited. Goodness, Wally, are you all crazy? You're so <laughs> handsome. No, he's a <laughs> lovely boy. He just gets very excited when there's Hi, buddy. Okay, so this is that jump in. Yes. So this is, I know, one of your number one. <laughs> exactly. That's a big number one because I just want him to be gentle. Yeah. With whoever is going to come. Um, you, you never know. Is it going to be, you know, like the mail delivery guy? Is it going to be mm -hmm. a kid? Is it going to be uh, like complete stranger? Um, but also, you know, just our friends. We just want him to be. 100%. Like, exactly. Gentle. Yep. So um, at this calm. age, Normally, my biggest suggestion, which we're going to go through um, when I bring him back and everything, is yeah. we're going to give him things to do. Okay. So when mm -hmm. company comes over, we're going to ask him to sit. Yeah, yeah. Just stay um, in place. Stay then. in place, mm -hmm. calm down, and then when he's calm, he can come yeah. and greet everybody. And we're going to teach exactly, him to greet Wally. with beautiful sits, mm -hmm. huh, Wally? We're going to greet people with sits instead of greeting people with all this crazy energy that you got, huh, handsome? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> we gotta get you calmer for your brother. Exactly. Huh. Yeah. Go on, huh. Wally. Learn some good manners. Oh, yeah. Especially before he starts walking or running. For <laughs> sure. That's why I'm in with the jumping and all that. Right. Also, if we add a lot more mental stuff for yeah. him, yeah. because especially when you're taking a dog out for a walk, if they're not main focused on you, mm -hmm. what happens is when you're walking them, they're just walking and getting all of their energy out, yeah. and you're just working their bodies, right? Yeah. And what ends up happening with guys this age, just like us, mm -hmm. if we go to the gym every single day and run on a treadmill, what ends up happening? Yeah. We can run farther, we gain endurance, it takes mm -hmm. more to get us tired, yeah. right? Yeah, like but if it's we can true. mix the mental with the physical, yeah. where it's, hey, you're supposed to be looking at me, Good paying boy. attention mm -hmm. to me, when we stop, you sit, yeah. And the yeah. focus is on you. Now they're thinking mm -hmm. while doing their exercise. So yeah. instead of Six. having to go on a 40-minute walk, you might only need to take a 20-minute walk yeah. because he's got that mental. Mm -hmm. Now, I do More break it up. Yeah. yeah, I do break it up, especially with our puppies, where it's when I say heel, it means come to my side. I know mm -hmm. you guys did the yeah. right side, right? Yeah, the right side. So Same when, you, right? when we yeah. do heel, it's come to my heel, right? Mm -hmm. Heel. Yeah. And then I say, okay, now you can sniff. Now mm. you can explore. Yeah. But when I say heel no, again, like we're going back. And then it's, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So he has an on and off. Mm -hmm. yeah. So he can still do all of that stuff and, and yeah. hang out and get out some of that mm -hmm. energy. But we start teaching him when and where to do yeah. that. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Not in the house Give with him. the baby. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So we just picked up Wally. He's a eight month old Bernadoodle puppy. He's ready for our three week overnight training. Um, we're gonna be working on a lot of impulse control. One of their biggest problems is that he's jumping all over guests, getting a little overexcited, especially with a newborn in the family. We wanna make sure that he's listening and um, knows his commands by the end of the stay.